Hello friends, myself Amar. Now in this video, I will discuss another prime faces control which is called as Spacer. Here I have created a project named as Spacer. It has a index.xhtml and in the libraries as you can see, I am using the prime faces 8.0 version. Okay. In the index.xhtml, I have taken the required prime faces tag. In the head in the title, I have written Spacer. Okay. Inside the body, I have taken a form tag, right? Now, inside this form tag, what I will do here, I will use a h1 tag. Inside the h1 tag, I am writing what is a spacer. A spacer is used to create spaces in layouts. Means if you are creating a layout with the help of prime faces and it is required to provide spaces, then we use this spacer control. Okay. Now here what I will do, here I will write, sorry, here I will write a ripples code, right, ripples code channel. Now here I am using a br tag. Now if I run this, then you will see the output like this. A spacer is used to create spaces in layouts and after that ripples code channel. Now what I want is that in between ripples and code, I want to provide some spaces. Similarly, between code and channel, I want to provide some spaces. To provide the spaces here, I will use the spacer control. So I want to provide the spaces between ripples and code. So what I will do between ripples and code, I will use a control which is called as spacer. P spacer. After that, I will provide what will be the width of the spacer. Suppose here I am providing the width as 100. And here I will specify what will be the height of the spacer. Let it be 10. Okay. After that, if I save this and if I refresh the project, then you can see there is a space between ripples and code. Similarly, between code and channel, again, I want to provide some spaces. I will simply copy this. I will paste it here. And here I am providing the width as suppose 50 and the height as 10. Let me save this. Again, if I refresh this, refresh this, then you can see there is a space between code and channel. So if you want to provide spaces between the layouts in prime faces, then we use the spacer control and this is the entire code. I hope you have liked my video. If you have liked my video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.